Do you believe it was terrifying, to be honest? You're... We'd never lived abroad before. Thankfully, my parents had, but a long time before. And your parents had, so yeah. they were really supportive. But it is quite terrifying, packing up all your things, resigning from your job, and coming to a school that we actually we hadn't visited, and neither of us had been to Thailand at that point. Um, but... I had left Europe. You hadn't left Europe, no. So, <laughs> thank goodness, when we arrived, the welcome we got, the people that we met, from the second, really, that you get off the plane. It, it's just, it envelops you in a community and and you're just part of it from the get-go. And I guess then you think about the tenure and then us being here now 10 years, it then it's that community that you buy into that then you know that your family can be part of afterwards. So we now have Quinn who's now in year one uh, and then that kind of becomes a thing. You kind of hear and you think, actually, could we go anywhere better? And the answer's probably no because we can live a life that we really enjoy. We can work uh, within a community, within an organization that is aligns with the values that we have as both educators and both parents. And then um, also when we think about Quinn, we think about what she has projected for her future of being here. And that is something now that I would be very reluctant and I know yourself would be to take her out of the opportunities she now has at her disposal that she can access and even just try. It might not be for her, you know, there might come a time when she says, no, this isn't for me. But at the moment, she's got so many things to explore and do through school. That she wouldn't have if we were still in the UK.